Welcome to Freelancer Series Revival. My name is Anna, stand for Artificial Neural Net Assistant. In this video guide, I will explain to you what Freelancer Series Revival is and show you the basics you need to know before starting your journey in the series sector. Freelancer Series Revival or FLSR in short is a multiplayer only mod for the game Freelancer that has a strong focus on keeping the feel and atmosphere of the original vanilla game while improving its multiplayer gameplay in all corners. Quality over quantity is one of the major aspects of the mod, which means that new content will only be added if necessary and using everything that the vanilla game features on itself are fully utilized. You are currently in Antarctica, the start system for new players. From here you can start your career as a lawful or unlawful player and get used to the mod and its gameplay. Antarctica is also the only system where you face no consequences if your ship is getting destroyed. It is recommended to prepare yourself inside the system before using one of the jump gates or jump holes. There is no way back to Antarctica if you leave the system. Getting destroyed outside of Antarctica has consequences, like losing lots of money, a so-called death penalty, which is calculated on your ships and equipment value. Fleeing from a battle is always a valid and better option in FLSR. If you are afraid of losing equipment, if a wing gets destroyed or something, you can toggle on a so-called auto insurance by typing the command into the chat while docked. It will draw in the necessary money for insurance each time you launch into space in case you lose any equipment. It will restore equipment once you are docked again and pay out any not used insurance money. FLSR features an overhauled progression system, which means that there are no levels anymore. Every piece of equipment is now categorized by the class Light, Medium, Heavy and Super Heavy. Each ship and ship class has its own setup of slots for these weapon types. In addition to this, you can swap out your power plant or engine as well as boost your ship with models that will grant your ship additional bonuses. There are a lot of different kinds of equipment. It is your decision on how you want to set up a loadout. But be aware, power management and mass has a big impact on your loadout design, meaning that a good equipment requires a lot of power or makes your ship more sluggish in its acceleration. Choose your equipment wisely because in FLSR, weapon and shield types are very important. Every shield has a weakness against specific weapon types, making your defense go down very quickly. If you don't know what weapon is good against a shield, look at the weapons or shield descriptions. In FLSR, some ships and equipment require a certain level of reputation before you are allowed to buy them. Earning reputation in FLSR is however different from the original game. Missions do no longer give you reputation, with the exception of bounty hunters. Every reputation is otherwise earned by solely destroying enemy ships. Be aware that losing reputation is quite easy by destroying the wrong ship or failing a mission. If you notice a mission is too hard, cancelling it is a better option than dying. To find out who you have to fight against to earn a reputation, read the faction's information in the faction overview menu. This information comes in four categories. Allies and friends of a faction that you should not destroy. Hostiles and enemies of a faction that allow you to earn reputation. Enemies generally give you a bigger reputation earn than hostiles. Zoners are an exception and currently only can be bribed to allow you into the ranks. Hope you live, Trent. F 
FLSR is an ongoing project with regular updates and improvements. Notable core features are entirely overhaul equipment and chip balancing, challenging NPCs, continued story of freelancer, improved trading and mining, cooperative content to test your skill and withstand. If you have a question or would like to give us your feedback or suggestion, feel free to join our Discord server and become part of our community. FLSR is a partner of the international freelancer community called The Starport. This concludes the FLSR new player guide. Stay safe out there, pilot, and happy hunting!